you can see that the other part of the parking lot leading to the neighbor's yard were also destroyed in last night's flood. The building also took a hard hit. There's still two cars trapped as we speak. But obviously, as a result of the collapse of this road, we couldn't get out. I think it just got exacerbated through the night. Uh, the water started coming through, it filled up the basement, the first, second parking, and then we needed to get up to higher ground. We got to the third level. Uh, we had no comms, we were trying to get uh, comms for people to come and assist. Uh, we were, Obviously we had no lights, no water. And up, up until daylight this morning we saw the first signs of the, sea, uh, the rescue team. And we are obviously thankful and we are grateful that we know I've been blessed that we are out. It's actually getting worse, we're not too sure the status of the building at this stage. We've experienced it six weeks ago, we thought things were good, we moved back about a week ago. We've lost a vehicle, a lot of belongings in the previous one. I think this one, my, both my vehicles are stuck again. And yeah, I think it's now starting a new life and looking for a new place and we have to just forget about our floating.